All right, now Samsung has pushed a brand new update for one of its features called group sharing, which adds a couple of new features. And this particular update reminds me to share this particular feature with you guys because this is a very useful feature which enables us to share the photos or reminders or the notes with the family members or friends with their contact number or the Galaxy account. Now you may be new to Samsung Galaxy phones and you might want to know this particular feature. If you're already a Samsung user, you might be aware of this already so you can skip this video. Now let me just quickly tell you what exactly this feature does in detail. You can see the description here. It says group sharing application is installed on Samsung Galaxy devices as a basic application. It is an application that allows you to share a variety of content with your family and friends on Samsung's basic apps such as gallery, Samsung note, calendar and reminder by using the share groups of Samsung accounts. You can also share profile photos with your friends on the contact app. The main features of the group sharing include share albums on the gallery app, calendar application, notes, reminders. You can share profile photos and auto hotspots with family. Now this is a very very important feature which is available on Samsung Galaxy phones and you should start using this. So that's the reason I thought I'll share this feature with you guys. Let's go ahead and quickly see how exactly this works. Now let me open the gallery application here. I'll tap on this hamburger menu. This is where you can see shared albums option inside the gallery. Now this is something a lot of us ignore. This is a very useful feature to share all these images or videos with the family. The moment you add the images and videos to this particular shared album it gets auto synced and auto updated with the people you have shared the album now let me tap on shared albums now here it says stay connected to your friends and family by creating shared albums everyone can add to i'll tap on get started now you can see we can create an album here i'll tap on create now here it says choose contacts or add samsung accounts you can add the samsung accounts or you can choose the contacts to share or invite people to share the pictures and uh, videos or we have got a brand new option here it's called share link anyone with the link and a galaxy device can join this particular album now i'll just tap on share link as you can see we have got the sharing page here. I can share this particular album link with others and they can join this particular album if they use a Samsung Galaxy phone. Now let me get back here. I'll just tap on shared album. This is where we can add images. I'll tap on plus button and I'll add a few images here. Let me open the recent app. I will select a few images here and I'll tap on done. Now, as you can see, all these images just got uploaded to this particular album and this will be synced with the contacts that I have shared. Now, I haven't shared this particular album with anybody yet. I will just tap on the sharing option. Now I can tap on invite to invite somebody from my contact list who are using the Samsung uh, account or I can just tap on this account option to search the Samsung account ID to share that particular album. Now let's go back. Here we also have an option to share this particular link. It says anyone with the link and a Galaxy device can join. This link provides access until 26th August 7.32 PM. So there is an expiry date set for this particular link, which is cool. If you want to add more people, you can add, you can add your friends, you can add your family members, anybody you want to add, you can just add them on this particular album. They will get an invite on their phone and they can start viewing the images and videos that you're going to upload in that particular album. Now here, if you want to add more images, you can just tap on plus. The moment you add an image to the album, the person whom you have shared with will also get a notification. As you can see here, this is how the notification you will get. New item shared. You can just tap on that to see all those images on the other phone as well. That is just fantastic. And this is a feature which you must start exploring and using it. Uh, let me know what do you think about this feature. Have you already been using it or not? Drop a comment and uh, give this video a like if you find this informational. That's all I want to share with you guys in this video. I'm eagerly waiting for One UI 6.0 beta. It is yet to be released in India. So at the moment I get it, I will be posting some useful videos for you guys. So stay tuned for those and stay subscribed. That's about it. Thanks for watching. My name is Salyan signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.